The show is going to go on once again at the State Farm Show Complex. It has mostly served as a storage facility for PPE during the pandemic, but there's now a plan to get back to business. Dennis Owens is in Harrisburg with the details. Pallets of PPE can move out so the farm show's more traditional residents can move in and millions of visitors can come see them. Those people patronize the hotels, they eat in our restaurants, they buy things they need while they're here. The state approved a lease on a facility that will store the PPE. Yes, Treasurer yes, Stacy Garrity voting by phone was an enthusiastic yes. I have been very eager to see the PPE moved out as have many others and today is a huge step forward. For security, they won't say where it's headed, but we do know who won the bid. Moran Industries, which boasts several warehouses in the mid-state, will house the PPE within 90 miles of Harrisburg and collect $3 million a year. Oh, I consider it a victory for the, the farm show, agriculture, and the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania. State Rep Dan Mount chairs the Agriculture Committee. He's been critical of the Wolf Administration for tying up the farm show with storage but concedes finding a safe place for PPE is a Pima requirement mostly ignored in the past. This governor didn't fall short because no other governor before him had these warehouses, but we should do it now, now that we're aware of this. But doesn't the state have land where it could have built a storage facility and own it rather than pay three million rent every year? But when they say lease, I'm like, here we go again. I know that they've explored every feasible possibility. For $3 million, I could, and, and I don't have to worry about land costs, I could build you one hell of a building. The Farm Show gets back to business in the fall with a dairy show in September and a livestock show in October. In Harrisburg, I'm Dennis Owens.